So guys, before this video starts, I just want to mention that I dropped some new merch. And as you can see on the screen right there, we've got some t-shirts, different designs, some hoodies that look really cool, and all of that good stuff. So the link is in the description down below. Check it out right now if you guys haven't already. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys the Cursed Dragon Mod in Minecraft Pocket Edition. If you guys enjoy, definitely go ahead, smash that like button right now, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and be sure to turn on notifications so you don't miss a video. So I just want to warn you guys that this mod is just insane and we're probably going to have to move to a different world because this armor right here is not going to be able to beat it and I'm telling you guys right now. And I actually forgot to give myself one thing and that was uh, the golden enchanted apples which is right uh, there. So let's just give myself maybe like nine. There we go. And uh, I mean we have never right. I mean it's the best armor you can get in uh, Minecraft in general, but dude, I, I don't think I can do this. You guys are not ready for this. All right, so let's just kind of organize our inventory. It's a little bit laggy. This mod does lag because, uh, well, you're about to find out. So let's just quickly eat this. And oh man, I, I don't know how I'm supposed to do this. Let's spawn it in three, two, one. Here we go. Check this out. <laughs> oh no, I'm actually going to die. Oh no, uh, you can see the lag happening already. This mod is just insane. Um, okay, wow, I'm actually starting to like a lot now. Can I even hit it from here? <laughs> Dude, imagine if this was the end boss, like in, when you go to the end. I feel like just, you know, the normal ender dragon is nothing compared to this. I can't even get a single hit on it. Oh my goodness, please, come on. It has, um, as you can see, it has like three heads, like those uh, legs are uh, actually heads, so it's a little weird. Alright, so I just went into creative so you guys can actually see the mob up close, because I mean, in survival I'm pretty much going to die, but there is a head, well two heads as the legs. It is crazy, and then obviously, you know, it does all this weird stuff, and I mean, do you guys want to see when you get close to it in survival? Uh, well, you're about to find out. I mean, I do have the enchanted apple one, but... If I wasn't, I would be pretty much dead right now. But look, even with Neverite armor, I die very, very quickly. So, I don't even know how to, like, defeat this dragon. So, you know how I had the enchanted apple on? Well, guess what? I'm about to not have anything at all. No armor. And you guys will see how quickly I die in survival. I mean, check this out. Pretty much instantly. <laughs> uh, I challenge you guys to try and beat this legit in survival. But I'm going to switch maps very soon, which is going to give me some very OP gear to actually get rid of it. But look, that single little purple thing just killed me. I don't know what it shoots at me, what like exactly what it is. But look, Cursed Dragon. That is crazy. I have nothing now. Where's my stuff? Oh my goodness, I just died again. Okay, you know what? Let's go in creative. And I don't think we can even spawn two of them or else our game is just going to lag like crazy. So we're not going to do that. Um... Does it drop anything? It doesn't drop anything. So that's kind of a little sad because I feel like, you know, if you were able to, you know, get rid of it, um, you kind of deserve maybe some really OP gear. But as you can see, it drops absolutely nothing. Okay. Um, well, if you guys want to spawn it, I mean, you can just type in cursed and yeah, it pretty much just comes up straight away. Spawn it in and yeah, this thing is just... Crazy. Um, I think it has like over 15,000 health or 1,500 or something like that. It is just crazy. And look, it does that weird effect. And then, yeah, it just kind of like goes away. So let's actually get rid of this uh, with the OP weapons. Uh, so you guys can actually see how we kill it. And basically one shot. So guys, this is the only way to get rid of the Cursed Dragon. And, I mean, again, you guys can try it for yourself and see if you can get rid of it legit. But, I think it's going to require a lot of work. Now, inside of this chest, check this out. We have everything OP. I mean, <laughs> look at this attack damage. You would not see this on a normal diamond sword. As you can see, it says God Sword. Uh, we have all this insane armor, so I mean, I'm just gonna take it all. So we have the full armor on, now let's get the weapon. And I mean, I don't think we can get really close to it in survival, so we do need a bow. And this is called the God Bow, so that's gonna be awesome. And we got some arrows, there is the Cursed Dragon, and we got this. And I mean, we can 
Use the- <laughs> Wow, that is a lot of stuff on it. I, I guess we'll use it. We don't really need this many OP stuff. That is a little bit insane. So let's eat the enchanted apple. There we go. I don't think we even really need it. Uh, because I don't think this cursed dragon can take me out now. So let's spawn it in. And let's see what happens now. Yeah, it's... Oh, wow. Because <laughs> of the fawns. It pretty much just gets rid of it once it hits me. Oh, wow. Well, that that's how you get rid of it, guys. <laughs> I mean, I want to actually, like, shoot it with the bow. So let's do that. Let's spawn it in. Just make sure it doesn't hit me. All right, here we go. And bam. Look at that. <laughs> I want to see in creative, like, with the, uh, the sword. The god sword. Let's see what happens if I just hit it once with this. Alright, come on. A little bit of lag, but boom. Okay, we there we go. <laughs> just instant kill. Oh, wow. There's like a lot of TNT there. Wow. Okay, now what happens if we put this on? Oh, that has a lot of stuff like looting and... Wow, okay. Um, Let's try it. Let's try this. I mean, I don't think it's going to do much because of all my armor. I mean, it just dies <laughs> straight away. Okay, you know what? Let's put off... Um, what if we just put, like, one of these on? Uh, it still have fawns, so, I mean, is it still that overpowered? <laughs> Let's see. Alright. It, it's still overpowered. We have to take it off. Okay, we can't do that. Whoa! Okay, that's actually kind of cool. Alright, let's do that again. Now, I'm pretty sure... Yeah. Oh, the Totem of Undyne doesn't really do much against it. Okay! Even though it's very overpowered... Um, okay, yeah, so, I mean, we can't really put on any of the armor, or else it just pretty much dies because of the fawn enchantment, so, yeah, a little crazy, but let's see if I can, like, actually get it from here. Come on, cursed dragon. Oh, there we go! <laughs> no way! Oh, I really wish it dropped something, like, maybe if it dropped, like, this weapon here, that would be awesome, because I feel like you really deserve it. Alright, guys, so, we're gonna create a new world, because I wanna test something, uh, to see if it's actually possible. So, it's gonna be interesting. Haven't tried it yet. So, Cursed Dragon, let's put that on. So, just like that. And with this resource pack, we are going to put on Siren Head. I wanna see if Siren Head can actually take on the Cursed Dragon. Like, I don't think it's possible, but then again, um, Siren Head is a little bit crazy, so let's just make sure we turn this off so no one joins us. So, create the world, and let's see if my theory is either wrong or right. Alright guys, so I want you to leave a comment down below right now, which one is gonna win, the Siren Head or the Cursed Dragon? Let me know in the comments below, tell me if you guys are correct or wrong, uh, but let's find out together. Uh, wait, actually, hang on, let me predict who's going to win. I've I think the Cursed Dragon's gonna win, to be honest. So let's spawn it in. There we go. Oh, man. Uh, maybe the Siren Head can't even reach it, but let's spawn it in. Here we go. Alright, let's see what's gonna happen. <laughs> oh, wait! Okay, wait. It's kind of doing something. It's trying, but the Cursed Dragon is just way too OP. But then again, I mean, Siren Head, as you can see, its health is still pretty good. Oh, man. Okay, let's, um... Huh, wait, where did it go? Wait, where do you think you're going? <laughs> Why are you going over there? Okay, um... Can you stop moving? <laughs> Siren Head again, do something, please! Dude, what? Siren Head can take me out, like, instantly, so... Uh... Siren Head doesn't seem to be doing much. It's actually lagging a little bit. Dude, my frames! Guys, I'm not gonna lie, that was a ton. I mean, a ton of lag. So, I don't think really anyone won, but to be honest, I mean, I still think the Cursed Dragon was pretty much winning, because Siren Head basically did nothing. <laughs> um, so yeah. There is one more thing that I want to do, and that is going to the end with the Cursed Dragon. So, I know it sounds a little bit crazy, but hear me out. I want to see if it actually attacks... The Ender Dragon, uh, it might, but it might not, I don't know. <laughs> I still think, like, it would be pretty cool if this was, like, the final boss. Because, uh, yeah, I, I think it's definitely a lot more interesting than just the normal Ender Dragon. So, let's go ahead and make the portal just like that. There we go. Um, and I do apologize for the amount of lag, but you guys see this thing, like, it, it just does so much lightning and a lot of, like, 
yeah, I, I can't really explain it, to be honest. But anyways, uh, here we are. We're at the end. Where's the Ender Dragon? There we go. So, guys, as you can see, that's like the normal Ender Dragon. You guys are used to that, obviously, if you play Minecraft. So, let's spawn this in. <laughs> this is going to be horrible. Uh, should we wait until it gets a little closer? Hmm. Okay, wait, hang on. Let's do one thing so it doesn't heal. Let's remove all of this. I mean, I know I'm in creative. It's kind of cheating, but... This is so the video isn't like, you know, a one hour video, so <laughs> let's go ahead and remove all of this Just so it doesn't heal. Stop healing dragon. There we go Last one and boom. All right, sweet. Now it should eventually reach here, maybe I don't know if I should use the god weapon, but here we go. Let's spawn it in. Boom. All right. Oh my goodness <laughs> Wait, it is actually killing the ender dragon Okay, interesting. This is how a real fight should be. <laughs> uh, come on, do something. You were the cursed dragon. It's actually missing. Um, okay, wait, I forgot this. What the? Okay, uh, is that everything? I thought I, like, destroyed everything, but apparently not. Okay, who's going to win? I mean, I don't think the Ender Dragon... <laughs> I think it's trying to, like, fly away, to be honest. I don't know, guys. Let me know in the comments below which one looks, like, more scary. The, uh, the Cursed Dragon or the Ender Dragon. Okay, so, I mean, the health of this thing is actually kind of low, but not too low. Let's put in another one. Okay, let's see. Come on, hit it. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but to me, however, I mean, if I was to go into Survivor right now, you guys will see I'm pretty much going to die, like, instantly. So, uh, I mean, if it does hit me. Where is the Cursed Dragon? Why does it keep going over this way? What if we use the god bow on this? Hiya! Oh, okay. Wait, what if I do it on this one? Oh, okay. <laughs> it just instantly gets rid of it. Uh, where is the cursed dragon? Did it fly away? Oh, I, I see the, the health bar, but... Where is it? Oh, it's down there! What are you doing? Let's get rid of it. Oh, okay, Enderman. That was not nice at all. Wow. I, I got killed by the Enderman instead of the Cursed Dragon. So, um, yeah, that's gonna wrap up today's video. If you guys enjoyed, definitely go ahead and smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new to the channel, and oh my goodness, wow. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. See ya.